Well, congratulations, you are watching my first nudist vlog ever. This is just so liberating. In the US, you get arrested for being naked on a beach. I love Europe. They just sat down over there, but there were two people stretching and doing yoga completely naked. So I guess there's a nude beach here and I'm gonna go walk along it. I don't know if I'm even allowed on it. I don't know what the deal is, but there's a nude beach here after the dunes. Imagine crawling out of the wastelands that are the dunes to see people's butt cracks. So I came over the dunes over there and I thought I was seeing things, but no. This is a nude beach, or at least a portion of a nude beach. Playa del Inglés is a nude beach. I brought a bathing suit, but we, we can just throw that away because you, you don't need that here. This is indeed a nude beach. And uh, so, uh, what does one do here? Think of this as a bucket list item. I'm gonna go swimming desnudo, as they say, because the way I see it, this is a bucket list thing. How many of you can say you've gone swimming in a nude beach? I'm gonna have a lot of editing to do, but I think it's worth it. But while I get undressed, I'm gonna have to try and stand in one place the whole time. Those are my feet, and uh, I got nothing else on. The trick here, if you're shy, is to get under the wave zone as fast as you possibly can. And that's what I'm doing. And it is cold, and there's the wave zone. I'm glad I've been running a lot before coming to this beach. Uh. Woo! It's crazy. I gotta be careful because my camera's not waterproof. Here I am in life, nudist beach. Bucket list. Oh. Oh. This is a new experience for me. Okay, I am back and I am packing my stuff up here. I am now clothed, uh, just getting ready to head back, avoid the midday heat, and uh, hang around in the air conditioning and swimming pool at my hotel. But this is something I will never experience again. Wandering through a dune field and ending up in a nude beach. Well, it's hard to see, but between those two buildings, the sun is setting, things are getting a lot cooler. Pretty much uneventful this afternoon. I just had to sit inside because it was too warm and uh, the UV was just too intense for this white guy. So it's getting a little cooler now, but I've got to get out of here first thing in the morning and head back to the UK. So might go out for a drink tonight, but the food options here are really limited, at least in my hotel. A lot of stuff still closed because of the whole COVID-19. But this was fun. I needed to get out of the UK to reset the whole uh, tourist visa. And now all I gotta do is make it back in tomorrow and it should be fine. I have every reason that they should let me back in. And things should go smooth, but just the plane ride and get back to the airport. It's the only thing on my way now. Well, that's just lovely. I arrived at the airport and my flight is delayed 45 minutes. And the sink of the bathroom splashed all over me. It looks like I pissed myself. So we're already off to a great start for my return trip. I gotta find something to do in the airport for an extra 45 minutes now. Oh, airports. 